Tonight, only on KHU 11 News, an update about a story we first brought to you earlier this week. Multiple iPhone thefts. Yeah, here's what we know. Teenagers are accused of traveling from Detroit to Houston to steal brand new iPhones off front porches all across the city. Marcelino Benito back tonight with exclusive new video of the thefts and details about how the suspects knew exactly where to find these phones. Marcelino? Well, Len and Mia, these suspects had access to customer data. Tonight, though, it's still unclear how they got it. What we do know tonight is all of their moves captured on a dash camera from inside their own rental car. Tonight, Deer Park Police tell us David Dye and Iyana Perry flew to Houston on a specific mission to intercept new iPhone 16s as they were delivered to AT&T customers. They came to rent two cars from us. One was a Model 3 and one was a Ford Explorer. Uh, they seemed pretty young. So, um, but they didn't seem like they would give us too much trouble. For the next 48 hours, a dash camera captured their almost every move, crisscrossing our area through different neighborhoods. We found out they had the uh, dash cam still plugged in. So it was like, okay, you know, let's go look through this and see what's going on. They're seen following FedEx drivers on delivery runs, but police say this was intentional and strategic. They had tracking numbers for multiple customer deliveries and knew exactly where to go. Desmond Garrick owns right away rentals, helped police connect the dots. We also have GPS tracking through all our vehicles, so we knew exactly what houses they went to and what exactly they were doing. And we handed everything over to the detective and he was pretty happy about it. Perry is seen on camera approaching a porch, but appeared to be just a few minutes early. The phone hadn't been delivered yet. Not long after, she returns and snatches it after the delivery. And in another shocking clip, Dai is seen confronting a FedEx driver at a strip mall. Police say Dai tried to convince the driver to hand him the iPhone 16 delivery by providing a real tracking number. And he tried to get the packages straight from the truck. Deer Park PD pulled over Di and Perry Saturday. Inside the car, they found four stolen iPhone 16s. Tonight, how two teens from Detroit obtained Houston area customers delivery tracking information remains the big question for investigators. Sources tell us there could be other suspects involved and police continue to explore whether this is a much larger operation. When I found out about all of this, I was like, you know, there's got to be someone else behind it all. Now, we know these two suspects were supposed to be here in Houston for at least a week, so it's likely there were a lot more intended targets. I can also tell you Deer, Deer Park Police telling me they're reaching out to AT&T's Global Fraud Department to find out how this information, this customer data, ended up in the wrong hands. Len, back to you. Yeah, how did they get the information? I know you'll stay on top of it. Marcelino, thank you.